Hey guys, this is Tonner and today we've got the new data mine. So we've got a new costume coming for Nova. We've got the estate from Kiln stuff and a maintenance as well. So let's get into it. So first of all, uh, in two days time, we're going to be seeing a maintenance. Now, this is likely to bring Escape from Kiln, I would say. Uh, I'm not entirely sure when that's going live or anything like that. But given the fact there's maintenance and this is a big game mode that has to go live and everything, we could potentially see it around that time. Also, the timing of it is interesting. 9.30 at night as well. Um, I guess that kind of matches their new kind of maintenance time. Like they're trying to do it in non-peak hours, which is nice, but... You know, that ends up being peak for me, <laughs> uh, which isn't nice. But either way, it looks like we're going to be seeing maintenance in a couple days time. Uh, we've got this new skin here. So this is a Wrath skin. Wrath, Wrath, whatever, however you want to pronounce it, for Nova. Um, Face with no other choice, Nova makes a deal with Mephisto and becomes engulfed in the flames of his rage. If you don't know, this is to do with the storyline. Uh, during the Nova trial, uh, uh, Nova makes a deal with Mephisto to be able to get empowered and be able to gain more power, to be able to go and stop... Um, to be able to go and stop Thanos, I believe it was, or Apocalypse from being able to get a big weapon. I can't remember exactly which one of those two. It was a while ago, and to be honest, I don't read all of the lore anymore. I've kind of been skipping over a bit of it. Um, but, you know, this is interesting because this seems to be similar to how we had the previous... Um, like horseman skins so it's like a kind of like a horseman skin where the horsemen were the skins that were all them empowered by apocalypse and everything this seems to be them being empowered by mephisto so i assume that we'll get a nova one we'll get you know a black cat one i don't know what the black cat one will be because she didn't exactly get empowered from memory i think that she just got um like she just made a deal with him so I don't know. Uh, and then I believe Green Goblin as well had uh, stuff to do with Mephisto within his storyline. So uh, this is interesting. This could be, you know, the start of the lead up to um, the lead up to uh, Professor X as well. But we'll see. And then we've got live escape from Kiln. So escape from Kiln battle for 40 cells for rewards. It's time to escape from Kiln. Don't miss this epic uh, prison break. Uh, we've got battle for 40 cells. We already know escape from Kiln and everything. Um, you're going to be getting Gambit shards as well as Diamond for Gambit, uh, complete the cells, etc., etc. A limited time event that's going to come back around. We'll see how they change it. I was kind of hoping for like a, a permanent-ish kind of event, but you know, we'll see. We'll see how often they kind of start repeating it. And then finally, we've got the Symbiotic Collective. So this is the battle with Hive Mind and earn rewards. So this is going to be the Hive Mind Showcase event. You're going to be uh, battling with them, doing the same thing as you do with every other bloody showcase event. Uh, you're going to be working on either Hive Mind or Symbiote characters here. You're going to need Void Knight, Gwenom, and Red Goblin. They're going to be required to complete the missions and everything. You're going to get the same kind of rewards as you got usually. Uh, so... We'll see. I'm hoping that this Wrath event is really nice. Um, or, you know, maybe they've got like some kind of new sagas in the works or something. There's lots of really cool stuff that we could potentially see for people to be able to get this costume. So I'm pretty excited to see what, exactly what they do there. And then we've got uh, the maintenance here as well in a couple of days time to potentially bring in the costume, bring in Escape from Kiln. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I've missed somewhere in the blog where it said Escape from Kiln's going live, which is per perfectly, you know, um, possible because I've, I haven't been reading the blogs as much, uh, or at least not, not the ins and outs of them. Uh, so let me know down in the comments, what you guys think, uh, just kind of normal stuff. Um, this is obviously the most interesting part here. So let me know exactly what you guys think and what you'd like to see from this, because, you know, they said that specifically, we're not going to be getting the sagas and everything. So they could be doing something cool here. Let me know. Have a great day and goodbye.